All right, guys, this one is a side bridge. This is a stabilization exercise, really good for the transverse uh, muscles in our uh, core. So what we're gonna do with this one, this is the same uh, starting position, kind of is very similar, at least, to the um, clamshell. So what we're gonna do here, knees are together, feet are together, okay? I'm gonna have that elbow underneath the shoulder, more or less. We don't wanna have it way out here and putting a strain on our shoulder. For the most part, we want to have that head fairly level. We don't want it side way down or way up here. So it's just kind of in line with your torso, if that makes sense, okay? Then what we're going to do from here, we're going to take that top knee and that top foot, and we're going to just put it right in the front, okay? Kind of in the middle of our shin, if that makes sense, right? We don't want to wait up high or too low, kind of like in the middle of that lower leg, if that makes sense, okay? So again, starting knees to knees. Now we're going to go ahead and plant that foot. From this position, okay, what we're going to do is we're going to raise that bottom hip off of the floor or off of the table, okay? And that really is all you need to do because when you do that, by default, in order to hold this position, all of this musculature will engage, okay? It is virtually impossible to do this without having this muscles engage. I've never seen anyone be able to do it. Maybe somebody can, but I haven't ever met them, okay? And what you're doing when you do this is you're breathing normal, okay? Normal, do not hold your breath, right? When we hold our breath, that increases pressure in the spine. That's not what we want to do, okay? So we're in this position. We're raising that bottom hip up off the, the ground. We're holding five, 10 seconds, normal breathing, trying to keep that head level and just coming down. Now, <clears throat> when we come down, we don't want to do this. I don't want to put a big sag in that spine and put extra stress. So we're coming into a neutral position when we come down. So be conscious of that, especially towards those end repetitions. So we're up, five, 10 second hold, normal breathing. I'm going to come down and I want to be conscious and careful that I just come back to neutral. Yeah, makes sense? We're going to make sure we do both sides, okay? So five to 10 repetitions, five, 10 second holds both sides. Again, this one is just a one per day thing. You don't need to do that more than once per day, okay?